the original Pomeroy technique of tubal ligation was described by Dr. Ralph Pomeroy from USA in 1924. In this technique of bilateral tubal ligation, part of the fallopian tube near the isthmus is elevated to create a loop or a knuckle. An absorbable ligature of chromic catgut is tied around the base of the tubal segment. The loop is then cut transversely. When cutting the loop, do not cut too close to the ligature because of risk of slipping. Check for hemostasis of the cut ends. The excised tubal segment should ideally be sent for histopathology from the medical legal point of view. Remember that in the original technique, it is a simple chromic catgut tie at the base. It is not a transfixing suture. Within a few days, the peritoneum grows over and covers the cut ends of the fallopian tubal segments. The cut ends separate and fall apart as the ligature dissolves over 3 to 4 weeks. The peritoneum covering and separating the remaining tubal segments prevent them from reattaching to each other. This is a simple and effective technique. Pomeroy technique of tubal ligation typically leaves two healthy segments of fallopian tube that can be rejoined by tuberoplasty later if required. This technique has a failure rate of 1 in 300 to 400 procedures.